Welcome back to another episode of This Is Fake, brought to you by The Collection Dimension, and another collector's review episode of the NECA Superman the Movie. This is the Christopher Reeve bootleg action figure. I unboxed the Batman one from the 1989 Michael Keaton one, but this is a uh, Juan Keaton. Make sure you check out that video. If you guys haven't seen that video of that unboxing, I've been meaning to get to this video right here. Gonna look around at him and the box. Definitely on the lighter side and how he looks. Don't have nothing to compare him to, uh, as in right now physical, or I would have done a, a unboxing. Actually, no, I wouldn't know. That one's pretty expensive for the real version of this. Um, but this one came just like the Batman one, this Batman one. These came together and this one, the box, it was out of the box already, so it's not taped shut. Um, it was already out of the box and the box was folded up to fit in nicely. I don't know why they wouldn't have just put it in the box. It seemed like it would have just fit perfectly when they sent it. But this is the Superman one and I also did one on the 1966 Batman. So make sure you guys check out that. Uh, this one on uh, this is fake of those two that one came with some nice accessories so let's get to this one right here first uh, I'm gonna show you guys that to tell on this one how it is fake is the sticker right here on all the bootlegs this image right here is see-through it's uh, so you could actually you could see it and a see-through just like this picture so if you look right there that's the main thing with this action figure just like the batman one that there was the box man looking at the box the box is real detailed pretty nice um lighter than some of the ones that i've seen of the real versions the real versions were a little bit darker the back not as much um but i mean the, the picture that i did a couple pictures that i did see but this figure right here we got to see how it is out of the box again I got the pictures of the real one that you guys can look at. And if I ever get a real one or get my hands on a real one, then I'll show you guys, pull it out. And definitely the, and what I seen on the bottom too. So looking at the bottom before looking at the figure, this is a 2015. From uh, what I understand and what I know, they only came out with this action figure one time. So there's not gonna be another number. It's just gonna be 2015. I don't remember them re-releasing this action figure at all. So the bottom looks really identical to the real version. Same thing with the top. The NECA, the, the, the NECA that it is even clear right there, the NECA.com, that's pretty good. So all around, now let's look at the figure. The cardboard feels real flimsy, um, not like NECA usually uses. Um, but again, I have not had the real. I do know this one is the fake. The real one goes for around $200 right now. And I bought this one for $18 shipped from China on AliExpress. So if you check out, I went to this link and that's where I bought also these Batmans. So that was 18 bucks. So let's look at this figure real quick, take it out. There's the back. Again, I don't know how the, uh, the cardboard is on the real version but he is tied in by these strings and again NECA I don't know if you guys ever watched fake versus real uh, that I've done or the other ones NECA doesn't do this where it's so short there is longer and they fold it in and then twist it also so that's how you can tell right now with this then also this is taped in uh, NECA does tape things in, so I was just saying this was taped in, so that was not a point. <laughs> so put the hands to the side real quick. And let's get him out of it and see him up close. Got him out of the plastic. And he actually looks pretty good. His eyes are a little bit like the... Alright, there we go. The eye on this side is a little bit off to the right the paint job on the hair you can see on the hairline right up here is not painted fully but as for likeness it does look like him it does resemble him 
I seen pictures of the real one and that does look real they they got real close with it real good ones then looking at his outfit again this was 18 bucks so the real one is actually 200 150 to 200 dollars if you're looking at getting the real one cape is the bottom isn't frayed you can pull it out oh there you go so you can pull it out even more let's look at his back real quick they line up the back is that's kinda nasty cause that lip sticks out like that I would highly doubt the real it one is like that paint job on <clears throat> the lines of the belt are not good like at all I know NECA could be bad sometimes but that right there is uh, pretty bad then we still have to see how his legs bend but that that right there is uh that looks like the toy is about to split open so let's look at the cape real quick again the cape is a nice cloth the logo's on there pretty nice not falling off cape moves all the way so you can be like this I don't know it's just situated kind of not great but so there's with the cape on he got a couple nicks so then some I don't know what that's from that must be leftover leftover glue yeah he has some fuzz on his arm right there that's not coming off but a couple nicks head moves around let's go through the articulation fingers crossed right side blue paint rub off right there side side his head seems real loose not loose to where you move it is still stiff enough to down stiff enough to move around up wish his head moved up a little bit more than that it's for the Superman pose then arm out let's try getting this again I ain't heat this up this came straight out the box and it's actually been sitting so actually that moved around pretty good <clears throat> no chest no upper ab nothing just no articulation right there elbow in and that that is about that is as far as he goes with the elbow in for me right now so that is just horrible let me look at one thing all right so everything that could have went wrong in this video has gone wrong for me <laughs> trying to keep on doing things and get this video along his arms bend trying to show you guys that that's how as far as his elbows bend then you see the parts right there right there the plastic horrible no top chest piece no abdomen piece he does not swivel at all at the waist then their paint job is real horrible on it and while I was picking it up real quick I literally uh, moved the legs just a little bit and Superman's legs uh, popped out so and uh, it actually was perfect um, for the video because it was while I was doing the articulation on the video and then uh, my camera died so I lost that footage too it is pretty messed up so we can look at the knee the leg articulation and uh, it's pretty some dark humor sorry legs that knee bent his knee bends okay it feels like it's gonna pop out right there just like it popped out on there it was connected by this piece so this like this and I literally just moved this is hard to move so I moved it a little bit and it snapped out so knees move around pretty horrible on this one so I guess I gotta move it around try moving it like that but it just feels like flimsy like it's gonna break it has no shin no shin movement just knee movement 
foot movement is not the greatest on this one again shoot it in the comments if you have the real version and uh, anything is different on it that I didn't catch sorry on the Batman one I didn't catch something on the last video no need to call idiots or nothing like that um, so this piece pops in there like this and this piece was just like that so with how this was and how cheap this plastic is it was bound to break but all together his the how he looks he looks it, I, I like the look um, of course the paint job and everything like that might be a little bit off but I do like uh, his look they do catch his look pretty good um, of course I don't like the legs falling off I could do with the, the legs staying on him um, like it's supposed to but again this was 18 bucks I was not expecting anything like amazing or grand I do like how he looks so if you get it just be very gentle with them uh, make sure you don't uh, bend the legs too much take your time because you see how it is right here and this can be a little hard to move especially this right one so the left one is easier to move because it's on this piece right here but this is on a ball joint so it does not this piece right here does not move that well like at all I'm trying to pull it now and it's just not it's budging just a little bit so that is his right leg or left leg and yeah so be careful of that the look of them I really like them the posing I don't know I don't have the real one so the posing I don't I don't like that he doesn't have a waist I don't you know that's not the greatest so I want to actually look up and see how people pose them um, so this was a fake action figure and I bought it through Aliexpress you can get them on eBay Aliexpress Amazon so be careful know what you're looking for like I said look at the logo the logo on it is see-through you'll deal with this again for 20 bucks compared to $200 if you really want this figure hey to each his own as long as you're happy with the action figure itself um, I wouldn't do a fake versus real on this one uh, there's just you could tell right now just with how it is the paint job and all that and the, again the real one is like $200 I'm not gonna unbox a $200 toy <laughs> for to show you guys that the fake one does this um, so again 18 bucks wasn't expecting the world. Till next time, this was another episode of This Is Fake. Make sure you guys check out the other episodes of where I did Juan Batman and the 1966 Adam West Batman. Those ones didn't turn out bad. The legs are still on, but this Superman is flying away. So until next time, wait, here goes the hands. Hands aren't nothing great. I'm not really happy about the figure breaking, but there goes the two hands. And I don't know how this is going to swivel. Yeah, so the paint's all breaking off on that. Like you see that? The paint breaking off everywhere on that. So, yeah. That's the hands. But until next time, this was another episode of This Is Fake. We out. Peace.